down the stretch. Fastball taken, but that gets the zone for a strike. Duffy, a runner at first with one gone in the inning. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. But that'll hit off the wall in left center. Duffy rounds the corner and is headed home. He scores as they extend their lead even further. Up next for Tampa Bay, the catcher, Mike Zuvino. So now it'll be the four hole hitter, Mike Zanino. He went deep last time up. Pitch on its way now to Zanino. Loud contact off the bat of Zanino, and a ball sent to deep left field. Gone! It's a two run shot to straight away left. His third home run of the ball game as this lead got even wider. Single right there. That's Up clean. For Three for four. He's the looking right locked in. Guillermo. Already Standing in now, Guillermo Already As he'll send a ground ball down to third. And that gets through for a one out base hit. Dan, after that base hit, he's extended his hit streak to nine games, and you know he wants double digits. Oh, there's no question about it. Listen, anybody can get a nine-game hitting streak, but when you call your buddies or send out a text message and say, hey, I'm about in double digits, so nine games is nothing to sneeze at, but he'd love to get it to ten. Here comes the first pitch. Belted high and deep into right center. Matuk ranging back to the track to the wall. And this one is gone. A home run. So a three run shot to right center field is fourth in the ball game as they just continue to pour it on here. You know, talk about having a great day. Four home runs in one game. I would say that's uh, more than great. That's a spectacular day. The batter, number 11. Into the box now, number 11. Bullet back up the middle. Matu is back, and he'll get there to make the play for route number two. Up Absolutely for jumped Bay. all over the that fastball, and it might have been a home run if he had it, any elevation under it, but it was basically right at the outfielder. Into the box, G-Man Choi. A swing and a drive sent out toward the gap. And that'll get down out there for extra bases. And he is in the second with a double, his third hit of the night. Now I'm not sure what else the manager or pitching coach need to see, Matt. He obviously doesn't have his best stuff, and the longer he stays out there, the bigger the hole he digs. 
Stepping in and ready for another shot. Brandon Lowe comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Stung into the gap in right center for what should be extra bases. He's in at second safely as a run will score on the play as well. Man, it's been like BP for these guys all game long. Getting production from just about everyone in the lineup. That's the seventh run they played it in this inning alone. There's not much more else to say. Now at the plate, Matt Duffy. He's doubled and singled in four at-bats in this contest. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Hit in the air to right field. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. But a big inning here is seven runs cross the plate, and this lead grows even wider. We're through five here at the ballpark. Tampa Bay leads this one 18 to nothing. Up next steps Kristen Stewart. He leads off this half inning in what they hope will be a rebuttal to all those runs they just gave up. Well, Matt, I think mentally they need to get one or two of these runs back right here. Just getting on the board after getting socked in the mouth by an opposing team can lift the team up a bit. We'll see if they can string something together. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Mm, pulled him with that one as he's way out in front. This is the bugaboo on the offensive side. You want to stay in there and work a guy's count and hopefully get into the bullpen. But when you find yourself 0-1 every time, hitting becomes even more difficult. And he struck him out. The tenth victim set down on strikes thus far. Well, it's been a rough series for him at the plate so far. That's eight. four strikeouts Mikey. in the first two games. So this pitching staff clearly has him figured out. And that'll bring up Mikey Mata. As with one away, he can't make contact on the first pitch. It's strike one. He's 0 for 1 thus far. The wind up and the 0 1. A bouncer up the middle. To his left, Velasquez. Throw in time as he's called out on a bang bang play at first. The cut when the guy in the mound is working on a no no this late, every play is exciting and stressful for the fielders. We'll see if they can continue making the plays behind. Michael right, Perez please. is into the ball game this now as he'll take Rays. over out in left field. Now playing left field. Eric Thames is into the game this as well as he's the new first baseman. Now playing first base. Number seven, Eric Thames. First pitch on its way. Swing and a miss 0-1. This offense is going to have to find a way to get going. It's happened in the past. Every team goes through it where everyone seems to fall into a funk at the same time. Everyone needs to relax and not try and be the hero and just start getting the leadoff guy on. Behind 0-2 now. Bases are empty here with two men out. And he struck him out. So it might be time to begin the countdown as he's now gone through six innings without allowing a base hit. Down in order go the Tigers. And
tee, they are way behind. Into the box now, Michael Perez is getting his first plate appearance of the game here in the sixth. Number 43. He's set. Here it comes. No balls in one strike. It looked like, from our perspective, he gave up on that one a little too quick and then tried to emergency hack late. Here's the 0-1 pitch. Oh, and he hammers it to deep right field. Gone! A solo shot here to straightaway right field. Number 13 for him on the year as the blowout continues. Now batter, the catcher, Mike. Stepping in now, Mike Zanino. Hit hard to short. Mercer is there. And a bit of a high throw that time, but no problem over there at first as they record the out. Now batter. Daniel Robertson will stand in looking for home run number three as we take it back to inning number four. And this was his second home run of the game as he's been dialed in so far in this one. First offering on its way. There's a fastball right down Broadway taken for a strike. You know, guys, sometimes guys don't like pulling the trigger. Oh, oh. They want to see something go by, calibrate the speed, calibrate the break, and then make their adjustments off that. Maybe that's the case right here. Oh, one count. Here's the pitch. Well hit the other way again. It's into the gap. Around first, he's digging for second. And he's not stopping. He wants three. And he is in the third with his fourth hit of the ball game. Oh, it's rare to hit a triple, but he's knocking the on the fielder. door of history right now. In addition to that three-bagger, oh, which is the hardest out. one to get, he already has a home run and a single. So if he gets a double next time up, he's going to have a cycle. In now, Guillermo Heredia. Line drive to center field. Catch will be made here. Tagging is the runner from third. And the runner scores from third as they extend their lead. Now that, that was a good fielder. controlled swing that out of him man. there. And that's exactly Guillermo what he was hoping to do. Get it into the outfield and pick up the RBI. Kevin Kiermeyer will stand in yet again, and he's looking for history now. We take you back to his last home run. This was his fourth of the ball game, and it needn't be said that five in a game has never been done before. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Swing line drive. That's going to be trouble. He's through first and hustling for second. Arms pumping. He's hustling for third. And the offense continues as he's into third with a triple. Up now next pass. for the Rays, number, number 11. 11. He'll swing it from the left side right here. Really doesn't matter what side the plate of this guy bats from. He hits very well.